Aloha and mabuhay. My name is Emmy Ortega Anderson, the host of Pinoy Power Hawaii. I want to welcome you to another great, wonderful episode of Empowerment. Our mission, we aim to enrich, enlighten, educate, and we hope to empower you. Today, we're going to do just that with two very VIPs, very important Filipinos, people, and uh, on my immediate left is Sir John Rustin, the CEO of CJC Live. Along with him is the Queen, Cynthia Altman, CEO and founder of FET. Our topic for today is called A Magical Journey because every time I'm with the two of you, <laughs> you take me on a magical adventure. So today, we're going to let our audience, our friends, our families uh, know of the wonderful journey that we are to uh, go through. Let me cry on you. That's good. <laughs> That's good. Before we start, uh, a little bit of a background <laughs> mm -hmm. because, like I've said, uh, it seems like everything that you two touch toge together turns mm -hmm. into gold mm -hmm. and diamonds. Well, I mean, we work hard. That's the one thing that, you know, I've you know, coming from backgrounds where we both worked as kids on farms and things like that. I mean, I know what it's like to run pigs, wife care about, things like that. I mean, mm -hmm. you only learn how to work from your parents. So mm -hmm. that's just a reflection of parenting that today what we focus on in the business side is do the best we can with everything we do. Mm -hmm. But if you already learned how to do that as a, as a child, it doesn't, doesn't get easy as an adult. But that's where, you know, hard work pays off. Mm -hmm. So it's sort of, it's something that ingrained, mm -hmm. uh, internal, mm -hmm. something that you picked up growing up. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, that's the whole thing about parents. They, they teach you a solid foundation, and as you go in business, mm -hmm. you learn not to quit. The biggest thing I learned as a young person is that as I got older, I saw a lot of people have dreams. And everybody says as a kid, when I grew up, I'm going to hire all my friends and start mm -hmm. a business just like in school. We're going to stay together forever. And it doesn't really happen. So in business, if... If you work hard mm -hmm. and you focus on the goal, normally everything you touch should be successful mm -hmm. based on all circumstances being lined up. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. really, really important. Mm -hmm. uh, all lining up. Mm -hmm. uh, let's hear from uh, the queen of uh, the chairman of the board, uh, Cynthia. You talk about, we talk about farming. We mentioned <laughs> farming, it. I mean, yeah. that's like the foundation of things. And mm -hmm. uh, Cynthia and I have uh, something in common. We grew up as farmers. Yeah. We actually, uh, well, I grew up in the Philippines um, mm -hmm. farming with my, um, my parents, and that's how we pretty much um, uh, had to survive. Mm -hmm. uh, so uh, the staple is corn and rice um, mm -hmm. in the Philippines. Yeah. And in order to grow those, you know, you have to write the carabaos. And I was fortunate enough to be um, able to do uh, and experience that. Mm -hmm. So having a humble beginning, um, it's, it's something that you can use as an adult. Mm -hmm. Like John said, uh, Sir John said, you know, uh, experiences that we have are the ones that carry us forward as an adult. Uh, so uh, with that, I mean, you know, you just have to be humble growing up mm -hmm. and humble living your life as of today. It's almost like an internal clock that uh, uh, wanting to help to run you to be more efficient, right? And uh, having the tools, uh, we started off with living uh, tools like the carbow, the cow, because uh, we didn't have the powerful equipment that we do today to uh, give us a shortcut. And I think that's back to, as technology changes, you have to adjust to technology. Mm -hmm. So you go from a shovel to a laptop. Mm -hmm. So think about it. There are people today, no disrespect, who still do manual labor. Mm -hmm. It is a needed requirement for any system, any mm -hmm. structure. But there are people now, based on intellectual knowledge, with laptops, computers, the internet, mm -hmm. the television. These are things that can create new industries. And those industries not only can employ people, mm -hmm. but they can change people's lives, whether it's financially, emotionally, whatever it might be. Mm -hmm. Technology used correctly is yes. really power. can really steer, uh, mm -hmm. save us time, uh, mm -hmm. resources, and mm -hmm. money. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. and, and with that, we can even do farming at night. 
Yes. 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 Right? Now we have electricity. Yeah. <laughs> no candles in the middle. No candles in the middle. Those, those uh, mm -hmm. UFOs or no. uh, flying objects yeah. that we can yeah. order. Mm -hmm. What are they again? I'm having oh, a... Oh, you're talking a, about orbs. It, it's, it, it, <laughs> you know, when you, when you have a candle, you're old school. But when you have a flashlight, you're technically advanced. Uh -huh. So I think that's where all tools, no matter what business you're mm -hmm. in, uh, whether you're a farmer or you're a programmer or you're a doctor, the new technologies today to be mm -hmm. able to do distant surgery where you can look into a computer and be able to operate on a computer on a customer or a patient, mm -hmm. maybe in another hospital. All that exists today. But the question you always ask yourself is how does it give back to society? All this innovation, all mm -hmm. this technology, how does it make society better and what are we doing to give back? That's what's more important. That's the million dollar, million dollar question, or yeah. billion dollar question in this age, right? Correct. Uh -huh. So yeah. all these wonderful uh, equipments are there for us, mm -hmm. but uh, uh, it's up to us to uh, mm -hmm. make it more effective or mm -hmm. put it to its uh, full potential. Yeah, and I think that's one of the reasons, going back to technology, I mean, unfortunately, we still have people that, like all of us, we age. Uh, we also have pain. We also have um, the normal things in life where we wake up one day at 18 and 30 years later you're 48 mm -hmm. and you're like, where'd the time go? Yeah. So that's one thing I think um, we're focused on is how to give people technologies, tools, and products mm -hmm. where their life becomes not, there's just this thing as an easy life, mm -hmm. but more comfortable. And I think that's where, uh, when you look at this type of platform for Think Tech Hawaii, as owners of companies, our goal is always to bring revenue back to Hawaii, mm -hmm. employ people in Hawaii, yes. but find technologies that makes people's uh, life journey better. Mm -hmm. And that's what we're focused on. Okay, How so do we do that? Um, I, I know you've shared uh, with me some of the things uh, that are bringing this magical uh, journey into pass. Mm -hmm. And uh, do you want to go into that? Uh, well, how did you get started, or uh, which product was most significant uh, to you? Well, I remember, you know, my my my, my stepfather is electronical engineer. So as a kid, we used to tear TVs apart mm -hmm. too outside a farm with my grandparents. Mm -hmm. And what we found in the last few years, the biggest challenge in America, no disrespect to the FDA, mm -hmm. is the amount of people who either own have opioid challenges. Mm -hmm or the 300 plus thousand people a year who mm -hmm. die from pharmaceutical approved FDA mm -hmm. drugs. Because we're so dependent and reliant on these mm -hmm. drugs that mm -hmm. uh, help to make us uh, feel good, but mm -hmm. just cover up yeah. all those uh, ailments. Have you ever saw a, a drug commercial that the side effects are less than what it does for you? More. Mm, more. No, it's always a long list, uh, you know. And they list. always speed it up to make sure that they cover all angles yeah. that it could cause. You Lots know. of suicide. Yeah. Don't operate mm -hmm. equipment. Yeah. I mean, right. That stuff is so sad because, again, naturally, there's everything you need from your planet, from Earth, mm -hmm. is already here. So we didn't need a pill for acid reflux because that's part of a dietary mm -hmm. change. Mm -hmm. We didn't need a pill to take where. It may make your knee feel great, but you have thoughts of suicide. Mm -hmm. So we found technologies now going back in time. You know, back in the early 1900s, products like hemp and CBD were used almost 30, 40% prescribed by doctors. Even arsenic mm -hmm. was prescribed by doctors. So what's, what's happening today is the technologies that we're using are bringing us back mm -hmm. to the original products that were taken from us. So I'm not saying that those products taken from us cause all the issues of diabetes, high mm -hmm. blood pressure, and all of that, but they have contributed by not having natural solutions. Mm -hmm. So a chemical solution in a lot of cases can't be processed. So products that we found like CBD and products like hemp, mm -hmm. the medical industry is going natural. The challenge is it's taking so long with all the prescriptions and all the deaths mm -hmm. to really get that attention. So in Hawaii, one of the things we're doing is we're bringing products in Hawaii and helping Hawaii companies distribute products. Mm -hmm. And as a veteran, there's nothing sadder than going down, you know, the highway, pulling off one road and seeing veterans that are homeless. And a lot of them are taking those prescriptions. A lot yeah, of that is affected <clears throat> because of prescriptions to not help them with PTSD. Yeah. It's really a sad case because uh, homelessness and uh, depression. Depression and mm -hmm. all these uh, things that uh, 
all these synthetic drugs that we're so dependent upon, which are supposed to cure us, right. is uh, bringing us closer to our grave. And it's, it's really sad. It, it's sad, and that's one of the reasons that, you know, in our last company we focus on, uh, basically, we donate services and monies to orphanages in the Philippines. Mm -hmm. um, that's really what Fetch does. Fetch really goes out there, and that's why you know, our, our, our family works so, so well together. You know, we'll find ways to create technologies and monies to be able to fund third party, the mm -hmm. orphanages and things we do. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, now we're looking to give back. The uh, CBD industry and Cynthia has gotten certified in pretty much everything you need to know about. Plus, she has a pharmaceutical background. Mm -hmm. I'm all natural in the sense of naturopath. I really never take medicines of kind of the other person. Mm -hmm. Most people my age are on three to five different medications. That's minimal. That's yeah. normal. Uh -huh. And I see, to okay. me, knowing that doctors now are making the transition to natural, I mm -hmm. use CBD because, again, as a veteran, I've had two parachutes not open. I know it's like to fall out of a plane. Wow. I used to play football in college. I fell off cliffs. So I should be a walking wreck. Mm -hmm. And my friends who don't use natural products, they're all on prescription drugs. Mm. And one will do this. The other side effect has to take. So you're, you're trading pills out right and left just to function. Mm -hmm. And what I found in the CBD space is that I used to drink 15, 20 cups a day of coffee. To get you going. To get me of back, the, so to speak. The, the caffeine yeah, the, uh, high. Yeah, the, the high, the uh -huh. caffeine high. Mm -hmm. Now I'm two cups every three days. Mm. And I contribute that to balancing my system out mm -hmm. with natural products. Mm -hmm. So when I look at what we want to do in Hawaii is we know that there are issues medically here. Mm -hmm. But also, we have to have an economic impact. An economic impact is we're bringing products that our companies have created mm -hmm. that are CBD broad spectrum, mm -hmm. which means you're getting all the benefits. Mm -hmm. You're getting the ability for the product to lower your blessed blood pressure, yes. lower your mm -hmm. cholesterol. It, it's so important to have a natural source do that mm -hmm. that doesn't have side effects. I know that, you know, I can't talk about skincare, how important it is for ladies, but we do have skincare products mm -hmm. too. And again, our whole goal is to create a company in the next, I hate, it's next 10 days, mm -hmm. where everything from CBD toothpaste, no more fluorine in your mouth, mm -hmm. which is a poison, CBD uh, shampoo, CBD conditioner, mm -hmm. uh, CBD weight loss, mm. um, a lot of people talk about CBD coffee, but all the CBD coffees that we found, the biggest challenge we found with those coffees is that they'll roast a coffee bean and they'll spray CBD on it. Oh, okay. So it's just topical? Yeah. So it's really not in the bean. Mm -hmm. So what we're bringing is CBD products that basically go into your blood. Mm -hmm. The topical side is a very good point because one of our products has emu oil in it emu. with CBD. Yeah. And shea butter. Mm -hmm. yeah. Shea. Wow. If you're a lady and you want that tight, smooth tight, skin, smooth well, skin, skin huh? you know, look all young. Wow. Imagine having a product that can cause your pores to shrink. Mm. And it's natural. Mm -hmm. You don't have a lot of the high alcohol based products mm -hmm. or like, no disrespect, because I've never worn makeup, okay? Some makeup lines mm -hmm. have lead in it. Mm. And don't trust me, go Google that. Mm -hmm. Wow. One of the number one makeup lines in the world, three letters, mm -hmm. C, A, and backward, has lead in it. Wow. So, and it's proven. So, again, I'm not saying it's bad for women because it makes women pretty. Don't get me wrong. Mm -hmm. But if you watch what is put on your face, sometimes it may make you look beautiful today, mm -hmm. but age you tomorrow. You have to be very careful because... You know, a lot of times we cheat as people because mm -hmm. we want the results right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, uh, it's the uh, after effect of having to rely on that mm -hmm. to make you beautiful, mm -hmm. that you're going to pay the consequence. You don't pay the okay. price. Yes. We're going to hold that thought. Mm -hmm. um, thank you again for being here. Mm -hmm. Really, really appreciate your uh, way of empowering mm -hmm. others. And, of course, always uh, your willingness to share your blessings mm -hmm. to those that are less fortunate. Mm -hmm. And we're going to continue and do just that. We're going to take a quick break. We will be right back here on Pinoy Power Hawaii. Hello, everybody. My name is Walter Kawai. Uh, I'm your host for our monthly uh, live streaming video uh, entitled Ukulele Songs of Hawaii. 
where I bring on guests. We enjoy talking story about the music industry here in Hawaii, uh, sometimes going back uh, 50 decades if possible, and uh, always having some good fun talking with entertainers. We're here located at Think Tech Hawaii, downtown Honolulu at the Pioneer Plaza building and uh, in their studios. And so join me next month for Ukulele Songs of Hawaii. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm your host Lillian Kumik from Lillian's Vegan World. I'm, I come to you live every second Friday from 3 p.m. And this is the show where I talk about the plant-based lifestyle and veganism. So we go through recipes, some upcoming events, uh, information about health, regarding your health, and uh, just some ideas on how you can have a better lifestyle, eat healthier, and have fun at the same time. So do join me. I look forward to seeing you. and. Uh, Aloha. Welcome back to Pinoy Power Hawaii. We come to your home every uh, Tuesday live at 12 noon. I am your host, Emmy Ortega Anderson, and today we are having a wonderful conversation. Uh, John Rustin and Cynthia Altman are taking us on a magical journey to a magical carpet ride. Yeah, You're Aladdin today. <laughs> Well, You're going <laughs> to... I got a shirt. Yeah, sure. the <laughs> yeah, every time I'm with both of them, it inspires because, again, we were talking before break about makeup and skincare. Um, and, you know, being around my mom, who is um, my, my hero, um, she was really big in a certain skincare company. And I think that's where going back to our new products that we're bringing in Hawaii, mm -hmm. with it being CBD-based. The ability to open up the pores, you know, cause your collagen to regrow. Mm -hmm. Things that women really go sometimes, you know, to surgery to have things like that happen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And again, part of what we're doing is we're bringing it to the people. So we are setting up pretty much a wholesale program. Mm -hmm. So anybody who owns a retail store, we're going to be the first company in Hawaii mm -hmm. where you can go to a website and private label all your products with CBD. Really? But wow. the thing that is more important than mm -hmm. Cynthia and all the smarter people in our company taught me, mm -hmm. is having broad spectrum means we give you all the benefits without the THC. Mm -hmm. I just want to stress that. Okay. You know, we have extraction processes where the THC is 100% removed, mm -hmm. so you don't have to worry about failing a test or anything if you ingest or put in your skin. Right. So if you own a spa in Hawaii, mm -hmm. maybe you're a resort, or maybe you're a clinician with your own, you know, um, hair salon mm -hmm. or a nail salon, mm -hmm. we literally are giving the CBD back to the people. Mm -hmm. So instead of you selling our brand, we actually create your brand for you. Wow. And so if you ever want to start a business, mm -hmm. CBD right now, it's the hottest business in America. It is. It's just, yeah. you, I mean, it's exploding everywhere mm -hmm. from convenience stores to the, the signs on the telephone posts. Mm -hmm. So there today is... Um, this month right now in July, we have 52 months is what Wall Street and Forbes says. Between today and 52 mm -hmm. months from now, it'll be a $22 billion marketplace. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This year in 2019, the first year CBD will hit a billion in sales. Wow. It's just like uh, being in the garage with uh, Bill Gates when he well, was <laughs> first started microphone. Isn't that right? It, That's always it, a reference it, point. It is a ground floor right mm -hmm. now. So... Hawaii, again, is ground zero for our company mm -hmm. because we live here, but we want to give the power to the people. Right. So a lot of the places that are nonprofits who want to use a product to raise money, mm -hmm. CBD is it. If you own a hair salon mm -hmm. or a barbershop, we're making, it, we're making it now so you just pick what you want. You want skin care, mm -hmm. shampoo, lotion. You want uh -huh. CBD drops. Right. Or even um, the CBD product for... Um, um, Energy. Mm -hmm. We find that the energy drink business is a one point four trillion dollar business. Trillion with a T. Not billion. Not right? Oprah it's money. trillion. One of the T's now. Wow. So we have a trillion dollar energy drink industry. Mm -hmm. uh, next week we'll start shipping into Hawaii our CBD twenty. This is important. Mm -hmm. Twenty five milligrams in a shot this big mm -hmm. that actually lasts up to six hours with no sugar. No sugar high, no sugar. and then the, the, the crash. crash. Yeah? So wow. 
all these people out here at Hawaii University mm -hmm. and all the kids and all the millennials mm -hmm. and people like myself who used to drink five, six, seven, eight, nine cups of coffee. Mm -hmm. If you have the ability to take one shot in the morning, the CBD opens up your system, homeostasis, all those smart mm -hmm. people mm -hmm. words that, you know, that, that my wife used. I'm, I'm from Texas. Small words. Works. Uh -huh. I like it. That's uh -huh. me. So that CBD product is ready, mm -hmm. and she's tasted it with our friends. They've tried it. Um, and a full bottle is just two ounces. Mm -hmm. uh, tastes like strawberries. Really? Yeah, with no wow. sugar. Mm -hmm. With no sugar. Uh huh. So Can I again, have some? Well, <laughs> you actually, you're, well, yes, we have, yes, we have stuff for you. But the biggest benefit is now, I have to bring this out. We don't diagnose or treat a cure. Mm -hmm. But one thing the side effect of this shot will do, mm -hmm. uh, people who, drink too much alcohol. Mm -hmm. If they were to consume a shot prior to going out and doing what they do, mm -hmm. it can reduce, because you can't guarantee this, it can right. reduce hangovers up to 90%. Wow. I think that's a positive that, thing. <laughs> that, is, that is awesome, because, you know, you uh, certainly have a good time that, that night celebrating at Rumfire or wherever it is that you're celebrating. Mm. Yes. And then the day after, Ooh. you you pay the you suffer the consequence of having too much of a. And what do you thing. usually take when you have a hangover the next day? Uh, uh, aspirin or you know, ibuprofen to take the. Is any of that natural? Many side effects. Thank you. Uh huh. So think about what we do. Not me, but other people. They'll go out and really tie one on, and they'll go take a synthetic product mm -hmm. to calm down the hangover. Mm -hmm. So that's one thing. Now, I know there's men watching this, so guys, it's good for you too. For you guys out there <laughs> with blue pill issues. Blue pill. Blue pill issues. Uh -huh. uh, the product also has been proven to increase the oxygen in the uh -huh. body, which means that the vessel expansion mm -hmm. of certain things can cause certain things to work better. Wow. So it puts a, that, um, a turbo uh, in your that, turbo. Turbo force. There you go, there you go. Okay. So because it goes into uh, yeah. all of the veins, all the veins, and, uh, all causes the blood, rush. the blood to flow and yeah. rush through that. Yeah, there you go. Uh huh. Without and, having the, uh, uh, the uh, deadly, blind, the, the deadly effect of that blue pill. Or call your doctor if it stays from her six to seven hours. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just saying, but that's really great because again, that that industry is an eighty billion dollar industry. Uh huh. Those Pills cost up to thirty-five dollars a piece. That's reasonable. I don't yeah. know. Hey, I ain't but there some yet. people pay more than that. <laughs> I ain't look, you know? I'm too young for that. <laughs> but I'm saying, if you want an opportunity, yes, to win yourself off of those situations, uh -huh. and we can't guarantee it works for everybody, but studies shown that the ingredients that are our actual shot, uh, there's three different products in there that will increase the oxygen up to ten percent. Mm -hmm. So oxygen plus good stimulated blood flow mm -hmm. makes everybody in the household happy. Happy, yeah. Best way to say it. <laughs> okay, so let's uh, let's hear it from the woman point of view. Wonderful. Let's uh, let's hear it from Cynthia no uh, because we want to know what is uh, there for women mm -hmm. to gain and benefit from. Mm -hmm. So go ahead, Cynthia. Well, we um, the product that we have actually will take you to a magical journey. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I'm just writing on that last comment from yes. uh, Sir John Bear. But, um, okay. you know, uh, mm -hmm. the good thing about our product is mm -hmm. that because it has the 0 0.0 THC, mm -hmm. uh, so it doesn't have a psychoactive. Mm -hmm. uh, if you take it internally, like you said, uh, that would help you uh, with the homeostasis in your um, system. Mm -hmm. So it actually helps you with your um, immune system mm -hmm. as, as well as your neuro. Um, system, your nervous system as well. So um, we have a face cream, um, we have eye creams, uh, we have sunscreen, mm -hmm. um, and of course toothpaste mm -hmm. that makes you pearly white teeth. Yeah. And that those are great, um, gives you great benefits as women because mm -hmm. you know we're always smiling, so yes. we want those white teeth, right? Mm -hmm. So <laughs> that's important. It's very important. Mm -hmm. So for those that don't want to go under the knife, uh, mm -hmm. I mean, yeah. you know, uh, literally uh, with uh, with what we have, uh, that would really help you with the tightening and uh, looking young. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's no guarantee on any product mm -hmm. or in, you know with any company, but um, from what we already. Experience, mm -hmm. um, you know, we have those um, benefits. 
So these yeah. are the natural fountain Fount of youth. Yeah, going back to <laughs> basics and uh, nature. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, and I think that's what Cynthia says the best because when I look at things from um, a personal consumption, you want something that can actually process through your body. Mm -hmm. When something's created synthetically, your mm -hmm. kidneys and your liver, which are your filters, yes, mm -hmm. they're not used to a synthetic. Uh huh. Yeah. So if it's not they natural, don't know what to do with they don't know it. what yeah. to do with right. it. Right. So I mean, and we talked about this other in other situations. People who have kidney stones, mm -hmm. you know, have blemishes on their liver. Mm -hmm. Things happen when your body's giving something that's not natural. So your body's got to figure out whether it's going to be a spot right. or a cyst. Mm. Whereas natural products will process through mm -hmm. because they're natural occurring. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. I believe that a lot of people who economically right now are trying to find that extra income. We'll be able to help them, and it's great because our company, we don't charge you money up front money mm -hmm. to make money. Right. We give you uh, your own online website uh -huh. or whatever you need. Mm -hmm. And if you have friends in the, the uh, spa business mm -hmm. or you may know someone that's in a gym or maybe it's uh -huh. a gym owner who's looking to bring in his own or her own mm -hmm. products, mm -hmm. it really is an open market. Oh, open market, but it's also available for the mom and pop store who's running the uh, grocery uh, store mm -hmm. in, in the corner. That is correct. And also mm -hmm. pride themselves on carrying mm -hmm. uh, their brand, yes. branding it. Yeah. That's important. Uh, I know we have a lot to uh, digest or uh, mm -hmm. to uh, uh, really uh, look into, but mm -hmm. how could one uh, be a part of this wonderful journey? Uh, well, I mean, we come on your show and your radio store because you're one of our role models. And what we do is, um, in the next few days, you mm -hmm. may want to go to our website. And okay. I'll put it out this one time because normally I wouldn't do it because I want to make sure everybody comes through you because, you know, you do such a good job empowering the community. Mm -hmm. So we're always wanting to support. Mm -hmm. so it's an easy website. It's cjclive.io. Mm -hmm. So it's cjclive.io. And by Friday, which is coming up, mm -hmm. you'll see that. Any small mom and pop business here mm -hmm. has a Hawaii-based company. Mm -hmm. This is important. It's a Hawaii-based company mm -hmm. promoting products and services that you can white label, private label, third-party proven mm -hmm. non-THC products. Mm -hmm. There you go. Wow. We've uh, shared a lot, talked a lot of these wonderful products that mm -hmm. are so natural. And mm -hmm. going back to the basics, mm -hmm. uh, something that is... Uh, beneficial to us, uh, really good for us without all those side effects. So um, I want to really want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for uh, taking me along on your magical journey. And uh, most of all, thank you for sharing and blessing others. You bless Pinoy Power Hawaii, Pinoy Power Radio uh, with the blessings and uh, the richness that comes from your heart. And I salute you and commend you and thank you for that generosity, and I know that it will come back to you tenfold. Mm -hmm. So thank you, uh, so. <laughs> with the uh, little bit of time that we have remaining, I want to say mahalo, maraming salamat po, mahebigan. Thank you again for uh, uh, joining us for another empowering episode here on Pinoy Power Hawaii. I am your host, Emmy Ortega Anderson, uh, wishing you all a magical journey. Thank you, mahalo, mabuhay.